Hi, guys, this is Digibur Channel. If you're searching for how to unlock your iPhone when it says unavailable, then this video is gonna show you three different ways to fix an unavailable iPhone without passcode. Keep watching, and you'll know how to unlock unavailable iPhone even without a passcode. So, if you have this iPhone unavailable alert on your lock screen, it's probably because you or someone else have entered wrong passcode too many times. Your iPhone assumes that there is someone trying to break into your phone, so it will be unavailable temporarily for security. That's why you will see the iPhone unavailable or security lockout message on the lock screen. Here you should also see a timer, it starts from 1 minute, then 5 minutes, 15 minutes, and at last, 1 hour. The more you try, the longer you'll be locked out. If you have the failed attempts over 10 times, you'll be totally locked out. So you should be very careful. Alright, so if your iPhone says unavailable or security lockout just like this, don't panic. Here. I'm going to tell you how to fix it step by step, even without a passcode. So, if your iPhone is using iOS 15.2 or above, then you can simply unlock it from the unavailable lock screen. That is to say, if your iPhone is updated to iOS 15.2 or later, and is also connected to a cellular or Wi-Fi network, then you'll get this erase iPhone option on the lock screen when your phone says unavailable and try again in 15 minutes. So now, if your iPhone is stuck on the unavailable screen with this erase iPhone option, this is gonna be very easy to unlock your iPhone. We just simply tap on the erase iPhone option. Then you should see an erase alert telling you that this is going to erase all content and settings on your iPhone. Up to now, there is no other way to get into a locked iPhone without erasing and resetting it if you forgot your passcode. So here, tap Erase iPhone again to confirm your option. And then enter your Apple ID password to erase everything on your iPhone including the forgotten screen passcode. After that, we just wait for the progress bar to show up and finish. When it's done, your iPhone will restart. The Apple logo shows up, you can see now there is no iPhone unavailable message anymore. You can now set up your iPhone as a new one and restore your data from a recent backup. So, if the erase iPhone option doesn't appear on the unavailable lock screen, there is still another way to perform an erase. That is to use your iCloud account. If your iPhone has enabled the Find My option before it's got unavailable, then you can surely use your iCloud to erase the iPhone unavailable screen remotely. Before we get started, you will need to connect your iPhone to the internet or the erasing process won't take place. So now, on any of your Apple device, simply go to iCloud.com and log into your iCloud account using your Apple ID and password. Now, we select the Find My Right here. You should see a map on the screen. Simply select All Devices at the top, and here, we select the unavailable iPhone from the device list. So now, you can see the Erase iPhone option over here. OK, go ahead and select it to place a full reset. Then, confirm your decision. As you can see, your iPhone will start to erase all the data, and will be reset to factory settings when it's done. In this way, you can get into your unavailable iPhone when it reboots. After that, you can use your iPhone as a new one and download everything you have backed up in your iCloud to restore your data. And in case you forget your iPhone passcode, and don't remember your Apple ID password either, 
I'm gonna show you a super handy tool, the iPhone Unlocker. It fixes any unavailable iOS device no matter what iOS version your iPhone has, and it doesn't require you to have the iCloud Find My enabled. So, firstly, I just open it on my computer. You can get it from appgeeker.com, or just click the download link below this video. Alright, when iPhone Unlocker opens, here you can see several options from the interface. Here, we click white passcode. And make it start. Then, we'll need to connect the unavailable iPhone with computer. And then you should see a sub-window pop up, telling you how to put your iPhone into recovery mode. So here, you can choose your iPhone model and follow the on-screen steps to enable the recovery mode. I'm using an iPhone 13 here, if you have an iPhone 8 or later, you can do the same. Alright, once connected, we turn off the phone first. And then, press volume up key, press volume down key, and keep holding the power button until you see this recovery mode screen shows up. Once enter the recovery mode, the unlocking tool will recognize your device automatically. Here, confirm your iPhone information and start. Now it's downloading a suitable iOS firmware for your unavailable iPhone to unlock. It may take a while. When it's done, we enter 0000 in the pop up box and click the unlock button. This will start the unlocking process to fix your unavailable iPhone. Keep your device connected, when it's all finished, the iPhone unavailable screen will be removed, and your iPhone will be unlocked, no need to use your lock screen passcode or your Apple ID. You can now regain the access and enjoy your iPhone. Alright, guys, we just talked about three quick methods. They are all helpful to fix your unavailable iPhone when you forget the passcode. Give it a try and you will get the access back soon. If you enjoyed this video, please give us a like and share it with anyone who may need this. Thanks for watching. See you next video.